So, hello everyone and welcome back to some more Cream Fun Dungo here on another advent calendar day and, uh, well, we'll see the boss, I guess. Or our arch enemy, whatever you wanna be calling him. I don't know. Maybe boss, He seems boat. completely unaware of how close I am to escape. <laughs> I guess that's good for us. Domino. Domino! Taking your first coffee break already, Calavera? We got a score to settle, Issy. You know, if I ever spoke to my boss, Hector, that way. You killed my best friend. You killed my best friend? The demon? <sighs> Manny, you can use a demon as a driver. Let him carry your messages, let him serve you food. But you can't ever start thinking of them as friends. It's just not natural. Well, doesn't matter, that's the case. How can you keep little children in a cage? How can you keep little children in a cage? Trust me, it's easier than keeping big kids in a cage. Well, sure, it's easier, but how? Why? So why don't you just sprout me like you uh, tried to at the Puerto Zapato? I think it's his boss that will try to do that, I presume. Not him, exactly. Why don't you just sprout me like you tried to put a sapato? That wasn't me. That was Hector. He's so unimaginative. Just wants to tie up the loose ends, you know? But I believe, however, that you can be rehabilitated through honest work. Uh, yes. What makes you think I'm gonna work for you? What makes you think I'm gonna work for you? Well, there's not much to do on this island if you don't work, take it from me. And think about it, once I'm gone, it will be just you and Meche alone on this deserted island. I guess that doesn't sound that bad, Don't but... Don't tell me that prospect doesn't appeal to you. <laughs> but to be honest, really, do we, we want something better for Meche than keep her in this island, surely, so... So why are you here at the edge of the world? What are you doing out here on the edge of the world? Oh, I know. I ask myself that every day. But I'm going to train you, Manny, to take my place here running this two-bit light bulb factory. So you and Hector set up a secret hideout to make light bulbs? You and Hector set up a secret hideout to make light bulbs? Oh, no. That's just a side benefit. The real purpose is to have a place we can lock up all those old clients of mine. Can't have good people wandering loose in the land of the dead telling everybody how we stole their double-in tickets, now can we? Uh, so, okay. So they've been stealing their tickets anyway. The good people's tickets. So they wouldn't have been even indeed getting, like, he actually tried to sell a ticket to Meche. And couldn't, because that ticket was already taken. You saw all these people's tickets. And these are all good people in this place. That's... That's, uh... I did not hope to hear that. You stole all these people's tickets? Okay, how much of this haven't you figured out, Calavera? Kapal would route all the good clients to me after he switched over their tickets to a secret holding fund. I'd cover up the paper trail, and we'd make sure that the pigeon jumped overboard <laughs> at the pearl. Great. I knew it, you were getting all the good clients. I knew it! You were getting all the good clients! I handled them all, except for Mercedes, who you hijacked for me in that ridiculous hot rod. Which I saw, by the way, last time I was in Rubicava. I tell you, Manny. Hot rods like that just don't look safe to me. So it wasn't really my fault Meche didn't get a ticket. You stole it. So it wasn't my fault Meche didn't get a ticket. You stole it. Well, it's your fault she ended up in the forest instead of coming here right away. But I fixed that. <sighs> one ticket for you, one for Hector. How many more do you need? I don't know. They're selling them to other people, I guess. I don't know what they're exactly doing with all those tickets. One ticket for you, one for Hector. How many more do you need? Oh, Manny. We never touch the product ourselves. We sell a ticket to unfortunate souls, unable to lead moral lives because of the crippling amount of cash they were born into. Uh-huh. But you could just take the tickets and leave today. 
but you could just take the tickets and leave today. We found a way to make the land of the dead livable. Why would we want to leave? Hmm. So, uh, yeah, nice islands you got here. Nice island you got here. Yeah, the previous owners didn't know what they had here. Let us pick it up for a song. They scooped out all the coral they could reach with their crane and then abandoned the plant. But we knew we had what it would take to go the extra distance to the big reef. Are you about to lecture me about the winning attitude again? No! Slave labor, Manny. That's the real Yay. ticket to success. I do not plan to exactly to be staying in this island for very long. I'm not exactly sure why I would be telling that to him. Because, well, um... Then he knows. I don't plan to be on this island for very long. Doesn't seem Manny, like the best plan. I have all the guns. I have all the transportation. And I have all the brains. What are you gonna do? I don't know. I'm taking Mitch out of this dungeon regardless. I'm taking Mitch out of this dungeon. Manny. Before I found her, she spent a year out there in a petrified forest alone because of you. By comparison, I'd say I'm keeping her pretty comfortable here in my uh, dungeon. Wouldn't you say? Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> hey, you do that, kid. Knock yourself out. Thanks. I will. I will knock myself out by that stuff. But yeah, unfortunately, he kinda does have everything at the moment. First things first, I think we should go, on the other hand, of course, to go and actually save our friend, the demon. I know he's still on that boat, clearly. We know that there's a boat there. We saw it. We know he's there. But uh, the only question is, how do we exactly go and get him back up? That's at least something I know we need to do. Um... I guess it should be upwards. We can still go down even if it is aiming upwards after all. We're going upwards this track. Uh -oh. Yep, let's just go and visit him at least here, see if he's okay. I'm sure he's there. I know he cannot be dead. There he is. There's our Clotis. I knew he would be okay. You're okay. Well, it hurt a little when I hit, but my head cracked open an aft panel here. I gotta tell you, Karnal, I thought you were dead. Oh, Manny, I've been having a great time. <laughs> Listen. I ask you, is there an engine that can resist the love that's in these hands? Apparently not. Hmm, <sighs> apparently not. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Oh yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea's good too. Mm hmm. The only question is how do we exactly get it up, but... You're here, you're okay. That's the important information, regardless. I'm not just exactly sure... How are we going to do this all? Like, I know I can get that lever or the thing down but it doesn't go that far down so what do I exactly need to do for that mm -hmm. not quite certain and it's not like it's the first thing we could do I guess I don't exactly know like at all what to aim for how was that even supposedly there? It definitely wasn't when I was there last. Hmm. I can't really do anything in here. It's just like those two locations, I guess, that it's showing that there is these two places to be at. Nothing anywhere else. Yep. Let's see. Was there now anything else? I don't think so, though. Hmm. I have no idea exactly where to go. The one thing that I have is the little, little, teeny, tiny hammer. And uh, <laughs> what should I be doing with it? That's a kind of an excellent question. 
Yeah, this way. Let's try to put it back down there, I guess. I'm not exactly sure it's gonna be there, though. All things considering. But, uh, I guess I can check. Uh-oh. Yeah, I don't see it, at least in here. Like, clearly I don't see it. What if I have it then to the other direction, or this track going the other way, I guess? I'll try that at least quickly. Just get out of there first, okay? <laughs> ah, calavera, calavera. Hmm. I really can't say I have specifically very good ideas as of yet. Definitely don't have. And I definitely don't see that thing over here. I It may be also that I just need to solve something else first before I can even remotely hope to solve anything over here. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Mm. Oh yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea's good too. I only have this little teeny tiny bit of a hammer. Hey, need a hammer? <laughs> If I have something stuck between my teeth. Oh. <laughs> hey, <you need> <laughs> maybe after dinner, if I have something stuck between my teeth. Yeah, like, yep, yeah, that's a little too tiny maybe for you. Just, just a teeny tiny bit too tiny. Just a little bit. Maybe he can attach it then when into that to go and get it back up at some point, but I guess we'll see. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. I, don't, I can't say I have uh, very many ideas yet. Let's try to go and uh, investigate elsewhere, I guess. I do wonder how they have the octopus working for them, though. Like, why does the octopus do anything for them? I don't really get it. I do not really get it. <laughs> Ah, oh, new person here. Ooh, to the moon, he says. Um, hi. Repeat, repeat. He's overpowered by his choice of tool. Chapito. Huh? Who? I'm. It's me. Oh, you is it? Why <laughs> I oughta look at my eyebrows? <laughs> Nice, um, trail you got there. Nice drill. Drill? This here is a cordless high-speed reciprocating chisel. And look, it's a bust off. They usually don't give these to the new guys. Uh-huh. How'd you get a bust all? How'd you get a bust off? I'm connected, plugged in, and I had some booty to trade. Trade's the name of the game out here in the big reef. Ah, uh, booty? Where did you get booty? <laughs> booty? Where'd you get booty? It's all over the ocean floor. Jewelry, precious coins, you people and your fancy boats never know about it. Because <laughs> you just never stop and look. Ah, uh, I guess that can be true. Well, give me some booty and I'll buy our way out of here. Give me some booty and I'll buy our way out of here. I traded it all for this beauty. You traded jewelry and precious coins for a power tool? It's a bust all. <laughs> that tool looks a little overpowered for you, though. That tool looks a little overpowered for you. Overpowered? <laughs> Nothing overpowers Chapito. If you say so. And relax, we're busting out of here soon, by the way. Relax, we're busting out of here soon. We, we are done traveling together. I work solo, my friend, and I walk alone. Huh. Well, I would like to trade. I want to trade something. Well, you came to the right place, Sonny. What you be needing? A gun. <laughs> a hug. A hug? Mm, nope. That's the one thing I ain't got for you. <laughs> what about the boat? There you go again with the 
<laughs> you know I don't like them. Why do you have to needle me? <laughs> a towel. Now, hey, you funny guy, chalkhead. <laughs> how about how about my friend Gladys to be alive? My friend Gladys to be alive. What? What happened? He went over the edge. Oh, stay away from the edge, I tell you. It's dangerous. I've seen whole ships go over it in my time. Mm -hmm. Their engines in full reverse, trying to drop anchor. But the current, you can't fight her. So stay back. I will. How about a pair of nice silk stockings? How about a pair of nice silk stockings? Ah, now there's a hot ticket item. I might be able to get you some, but I gotta tell you, you couldn't afford it. Aww. A drink? A drink. Ha! We're swimming <laughs> in the biggest drink there is. Drinks aren't a hot commodity down here. Sorry. Well, what about a gun? A gun? Ooh, that's gonna cost some. What do you got on you? Uh, my turtleneck. <laughs> I think it's some sort of blue-green algae. I think it's some form of blue-green algae. Ah, oh, don't worry, you get used to it. When you got something worth trading, come see old Chapito. He'll do you right. Stupid chisel. <laughs> well, I do want to at least check the other couple of options. But yeah, it's just interesting to always see all the options and choices of those. It's interesting. Well, I got a long day here. Well, what about this then? Yo, Beto, have you ever seen an authentic little chipper? A little chipper? No, I haven't. But I'd sure love to give it a test drive. Say, little chipper, you're okay. <laughs> Maybe you're happier now. <laughs> da <-de> -da -da. <laughs> Gonna see Miss Liza. You seem to be a lot happier with that little sizzle, though. Like, lots happier. Oh, it's a bus da -da -da. <laughs> um. Mississippi. I wonder what you would be thinking about this guy. Miss Liza. Ah, oh, sweet Mary. Get that away from me. I got my own tools, thank you. <laughs> I guess that's all I can hope to be <laughs> getting from this, to be honest. Oh, rusty anchor. <laughs> I wonder what he would say again about this. Yeah, I need a new eye. <laughs> but I wanted to see what you say about it. Okay, well, hey. Well, hey. We get something beneficial. But yeah, I don't exactly... Uh oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. They take hold of that quickly. Don't go overboard, please. <laughs> Yeah, just, just, just grab it. The current is indeed strong, that's, that's certainly true. Now it was uh, very, very proven. Well, at least we got something a little bit different. We traded one item to another item. And uh, so it goes. I'm not exactly sure how we're gonna get that huge ship out of there. Well, like, of course it has something to do with that thing over there, but... How exactly? I don't know. I don't know. Let's go see the kids. The kids can fly, so that's something. Maybe they could connect it into there if they were free. Maybe I can free them with this thing. Can I talk to you anymore? Hello, Mr. Mean Boss Guy. Hey, would one of you children happen to have a gun. Hey, would one of you children happen to have a gun? Yeah, we do. So stick him up. Let me see it. He doesn't have one. He's such a liar. Oh, yeah? Well, you're stupid. But your light bulbs don't work. Your light bulbs all smell like boogers. <laughs> ah, nobody thinks you're funny anymore. Oh, yeah? Well, everybody in this cage is smarter than you. Everybody <laughs> except for you. Yeah, because I'm especially smarter than you. In your dreams. <laughs> <laughs> your baby bed that's all wet, could you wet in it? Shut up! Bed wetter! I said shut up! 
No, no, really. I have to sleep with an umbrella down here. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, at least I never asked Meche to marry me. What? What? Miss Kolomar, you're so pretty. Will you marry me? I <laughs> never said that! Oh, Miss Kolomar! Stupid beanie blue beanie bedwetter! Pugsy the Bugsy lies like a rugsy. Will you two just shut up? <laughs> Oh my goodness, now they start crying again. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, Manny, 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 Manny. How could you do that? How could you shout at them like that? It's okay. It's okay. Don't cry, children, okay? Hey, hey. Don't cry, children. Please. Stop crying. Why am I so bad at this? You children just wait here and be brave with lots of people, okay? Okay. Okay. Okay, let's look at this then. That's the door to the cage. Duh. Fly, be free, go by Domino. Leave us alone. If we get out again, he'll hurt Meche. Fine then, stay in there. He is mean. Well, I can open it, but it didn't seem to be very useful. I don't think this drill will work as a gun. I can't show it to Meche and say I have a gun. It does kind of look like a gun, but I don't think it works as a gun. No matter how much I might like it to be like a gun. What do you think about my gun? I think I'd try couples counseling first. <laughs> maybe, maybe that's a better choice. Maybe that's a better choice. Hmm. I'm just really, I'm a little bit unsure how to do things then. It's not like I can even do anything in here. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. It's not like there is anything in those uh, more in there I like anyway. The new dress. Well, it's the best I could pull together. Hey, about that gun. Ready to hand over your heater? I would if I had one. Right. Listen, Mechi. Manny, talking isn't helping right now, okay? <sighs> You're just not believing me, but they didn't give me anything when I left off because it's not like I was supposed to be in the freaking thing. Children's books. I like to read to the Angelito. It reminds me of better times. I can't bet that. It's locked. Why must it be locked? Why can't I open it? I don't want to bust all that. <laughs> oh dear. What do I want to bust out though? That's the question. What do? Sir, do you have an appointment? I'm going in there to tell Domino my demands. I don't think you fully understand the chain of command around here. Pugsy and BB work for you. You and I work yes, for Domino. Yes, yes. Works for Hector Le Mans, crime boss of El Maro. Well, I think it's time for a little corporate restructuring. Oh dear! Oh dear! Oh dear! Oh dear! Hmm. I don't really know how I should be continuing from this. Like, the place seems to be relatively small, but what is it that I need to do exactly is a little bit of a question. Well, I guess I can ask if he wants this drill in the... out there, but I doubt he wants the drill, as in Clot is wanting the drill. I doubt it. Uh, sweet Mary. If I have something else to trade him, maybe he can give us a gun. But I doubt that's gonna happen. I very highly doubt that would be happening. Later, Man, if I had only gotten that book back from Tilly, I could really start chipper. some trouble here. Just hmm. be a little chipper. Yes, you are uh, the little shipper. <laughs> but yeah, you seem to be a lot happier with the little shipper rather than a, the trail, a bust all trail. Lots happier, so at least it's that. Uh, let me go and check on this. Even though I kind of doubt this is what I would need to do. I can then try to go, of course, into the beach and try to do something in there, maybe. But we'll see, we'll see. I don't know. I don't know yet. I don't know at all. 
I would like to in some of these cases definitely skip because it takes a while to try to get here, especially when I don't have any idea if this is actually going to be in any way useful. But hey, might as well try. It's a good thing that we have you here though. Hey, need one of these? Uh, that would have been easier to get her open than with my head, but it's too late now. Hmm. Well, good to know that it might have been useful at one point. <laughs> Even if not exactly anymore. Well, I can't exactly make out what the name is supposed to be. Let's try to go and visit the beach. Maybe there's something that I can use the drill for because the cage isn't something that the cage I can even just open just like that too. It's not like that's a problem in any way to open the cage for the Angelicas. And uh, hmm. I just don't quite know. There just isn't really anything to interact in here. I kind of really wish there were, but there isn't. If I put it into here, then at least I can try to see if I can use the drill in this, if I for whatever reason would wanna. Don't know exactly why I would wanna, but I can if I wanna. <laughs> um, well... Not gonna put it there, I know, but anyways, I'll just. I don't wanna bust all that. Eh, no, not bunny, wanting to bust all that. Just run. I know you're gonna be a while before you get there, and you're not gonna use it on this anyway, so. I'm gonna just see. I don't wanna bust all that. But if there would be only like this chain, I guess I could be trying to attach it straight to the boat, rather, and then just pick it up with that. I guess that could work. Okay, so we do... Oh. Oh. Well. I can see why they don't give these chisels to the new guys. Yeah. That uh, did quite a bit of damage. The scoops learned its lesson. <laughs> Has it I don't now? Bust all that. Oh dear. Well, um, yeah. This scoop looks heavier than my last ship. It's not a handheld device. Well. That's, um, uh, that's taken care of, but there definitely doesn't seem to be anything over here. It seems a little bit useless for me to be heading all the way over there at the moment when there doesn't seem to be anything. But so, I made something happen, some little progress, that's, that's good. Now just to figure out what the hell am I gonna do with that then. Can I now attach it to the ship, get it up, something like that, maybe, 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 maybe. Maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Um... Doesn't really seem that there's... Oh, yes, yes, there is that, that chain. I was like wondering, is there anything attached to it anymore? But there is that chain. So that's perfect. Okay. Alrighty. That's something that I was kind of hoping for. And then we, if we reverse this, then that's probably gonna help us also to actually get this up and stuff. Okay. So, hey. Something fought. Something fought. This would need to be somehow attached. I'm not sure how that's gonna be done, but... I hope we can figure something out. Is it straight attached now? Do I need to do anything on that? Not quite certain. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Oh yeah, good point. I would Yes. Very good point. Huh. No idea if it's then properly attached or something. Because this looks just like it's this chain, but I don't know if that's actually the case or not. I guess we can try to reverse this now and see what's gonna happen. Hmm. I don't know. Was there something I was able to do here, other than just uh, move? Don't think so. I don't think so. Well, God, this is alive. We got this a little bit better situation. So hey, that's all good. 
What if we now reverse this? Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't have the boat in it attached, so what can I do about that, I wonder? <sighs> huh. I don't quite know nor understand yet. Hmm. I'm gonna check what happens with it in here, because I was thinking indeed that there is this grinder in here, so maybe that somehow could be useful. So I was indeed thinking that can we just put it into here now? And we were able to. I wonder. Huh. But it's not like I have any sort of a tool to try to do anything with that now. I don't wanna bust all that. But maybe that can somehow make the that chain better so that I can actually try to do something better with it. I don't know. Well that definitely did something. Okay. Well, there's a full, big, wide, open hole now, and I guess we got some grinder parts here too, so hey, um, whatever we would be wanting to do with this, I guess. We definitely missed the Domino's place now. It. Yeah. I don't need the hernia. Maybe if I had some giant steel hair to curl. <laughs> maybe then, yes, maybe then. Like so much stuff, I don't know. But there's definitely still nothing in here, exactly. Huh. Well, we broke it. What exactly ever we exactly achieved with it. We did it. Woohoo. I don't think there's anything in here, though. Otherwise, what we would need or want. Yep. Okay. We should still have that chain. Just a bit of a different question, exactly, like... I, I just can't see any of it, so it's kind of confusing a bit. Let's go down. I just don't know how I'm supposed to like attach that into the ship or something, if that's what I'm supposed to do. And it's not like it's gone anywhere future in there so that I could be seeing it from the other side or something, so it's a bit confusing. Just a little bit confusing. Well, I'll at least say first. I do wish that this travel wouldn't always <laughs> take so long. Maybe it's just that Glottis needs to now do something over there. And I don't know what use I had for getting those grinders apart. Like at all. It's so weird because this seems like it's all... I just see this shade. Nothing else. So it's like, well, um, hmm. What am I exactly going to do with this fact? I don't know at all. It's not like I can use not the... Inventory right here, yep, that's what I was thinking of. I can't use the inventory here, certainly. I guess if I can put something onto it when the rope or this uh, chain would be up there or something. And take that down. I don't know. But of course a sus, because there's a lot more chain now, it makes sense that it can reach all the way there. But probably then would need something to attach it into there, so, or something, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, man. What am I supposed to do now? That's the that's my question. What's the next step? I got some progress, but 
Definitely could have more progress. <laughs> definitely could have some more. I definitely do not have any sort of a gun. Would you guys want to have a trail? That's a little bit of overkill considering it's not locked. Do you want the... Hey, kiddles. Check out my bone saw. Oh, dear. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why did we do this? Come on, come on. <sighs> okay, I'm just gonna open this cage. Oh my goodness. Don't cry, okay? At least they listened to that. So, hey, that's something. Oh my goodness. Last chance. <laughs> Stay in there. He is mean. That's the door to the cage. Duh. Hmm. Can I bust this? <laughs> I don't know really what I'm doing. It doesn't have. Bust all that. Why not? It doesn't have even the lockers thing, so it seems like a logical place to bust out, bust open. Hmm. Okay, I guess this is an okay place to end for today, for this uh, Cream Fandango episode. We got a little bit forward, not that much. Next time I probably will have to cut a lot more out, because I'm uh, at a loss what to do exactly next. Quite a bit at a loss. Hmm. Yeah, but... All of that stuff, I, I guess this is a decent place to stop. So thank you for watching and I'll see you again tomorrow for more. So bye bye till then.